Uh, my name is Andy Suikwe and I am from a small town in the Northern Cape called Uppington. So the people that inspire me are quite a couple of them. Um, uh, Aldrin St. Pierre, a well-known news anchor, very good at what he does. Um, he inspires me. I think he's one of the reasons why I want to go into news uh, production. Um, but also other people outside of the journalism career, um, such as uh, Shauna, the late Shauna Ferguson, um, Connie Ferguson, um, Usindi Dla, to those are the people that inspire me, and I think those are the people that inspired my, my acting career. But there's also someone who's not well known, who goes by the name of Leslie Swart. She was my high school drama director, and she really inspired me to follow my dream of acting and just pursue the world of creating, yeah. Outside of, of, of journalism, uh, I read, I love, I enjoy reading. Um, I'm, an, I'm an actor too, so I participate in theatre productions. Um, but also I'm a radio host at uh, the university's radio um, called Rhodes Music Radio. So I do that part time too. Break! And that was Zex Bantuni's summer hit or summer. Thank you so much for tuning in. I came to Rhodes University because it is uh, one of the best uh, or not even one of the best, it's actually the best journalism and media studies school in Africa. So I mean, who wouldn't want to graduate from the best in Africa? So that's why I came here, but also it's such a small and intimate environment and I just enjoy the small intimacy about the university, so that's why I came here. And where do I see myself in the future? Definitely um, working for a news agency in South Africa, it being Newsroom Africa, SABC, ENCA. Um, I would love to produce news, be behind the camera, but also be in front of the camera. I'd really love to be a news anchor. I, I love hard news and what inspired it, or what motivated it rather, was the shutdown in 2021 that happened here in Makanda. Um, uh, as TV3 students, we had to go there and you know interview the community members, we had to shoot, get visuals of what was happening at the protest. And that motivated it a lot for me because I enjoyed being around the commotion and speaking to members of the community, hearing what they had to say. And also I feel like I am here to tell people stories and through my job, I can tell those stories and yeah, and reach out to people in higher power so that they can reach out and listen to what uh, people have to say.